Have you seen these labels before? These are energy labels issued by the National Environment Agency or NEA for household appliances such as air conditioners and refrigerators. Each label shows the estimated energy consumption and the cost of an appliance in a year. The more ticks an appliance has, the more energy and cost efficient it is. In this video, I will show you how to calculate energy consumption and the cost of using electricity and explain why using energy efficient appliances is important. This demo kit is a simulation setup consisting of main household electrical components put together into a single panel. I will be using the electricity meter and power points. Let's calculate the energy consumption of boiling water. This electric kettle has a power rating between 1680 and 2000 watts. For calculation purposes, I will use the average value of 1840 watts. I will boil 1 litre of water using this kettle. The initial reading on the electricity meter is 0 0.910 kilowatt hour. I will now start the boiling process. It takes about 3 minutes and 19 seconds to boil 1 litre of water. The final reading on the electricity meter is 1.010 kilowatt hours. The energy consumption in joules is calculated as power in watts multiplied by time in seconds. In this case, the energy consumption is about 366,000 joules. Notice that calculating energy consumption in joules gives us a very large value to handle. For practical purposes, we usually calculate energy consumption in kilowatt hours. The energy consumption in kilowatt hours is calculated as the power in kilowatts multiplied by time in hours. This gives a value of 0.102 kilowatt hour. You see that calculating in kilowatt hour gives us a much smaller value that is easier to compute. Let's compare this value to the actual energy consumption using the readings from the electricity meter. The actual energy consumption is the difference between the final and initial electricity meter readings. This gives a value of 0.100 kilowatt hour. You can see that the calculated energy consumption is very close to the actual energy consumption from the electricity meter readings. This is a utilities bill of a three-room flat for the month of October. The cost of electricity is 20.30 cents per kilowatt hour. Based on the actual energy consumption in the previous experiment, it costs 2.03 cents to boil one liter of water. You can also estimate the cost of operating an appliance using its power rating, the duration of use, and the cost of electricity per kilowatt hour. In this segment, we are going to compare some properties of an LED bulb and a filament bulb. Let's calculate the energy consumption of LED bulb over a period of 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, the energy consumption of the LED bulb is 0.002 kilowatt hour. The LED bulb has a maximum intensity of about 19,540 lux. The temperature of the LED bulb is 22.3 degrees Celsius. Let's calculate the energy consumption of this filament bulb over a period of 10 minutes. The energy consumption of the filament bulb is 0.018 kilowatt hour. The filament bulb has a maximum intensity of about 15,400 lux. The temperature of the filament bulb is 31.8 degrees Celsius. In summary, an LED bulb is brighter, generates less heat, and uses less energy than a filament bulb. 
Hence, we should switch to using LED bulbs, if possible. The next time you shop for household appliances, remember to look out for those with more ticks on their energy labels or appliances that work at a lower power rating.